Reality. Hi, cozy friends. So the game kind of just jumped into everything. It just started. <laughs> I'm excited to try Eastward. So I was sent this and I was so excited because I wanted to do this anyways. I think I talked about it on stream how much I wanted to try out Eastward. It's been a long time coming. I know. I really don't know much about it, to be honest. I think I've watched like a tiny bit of somebody play and I've seen just like visuals from it and it just looks beautiful. I'm kind of going in blind though. Like I don't even really know the storyline. So I'm excited. Let's get into it. Once upon a time in the farthest reaches of the continent, there sat a prosperous kingdom with a soaring tower that reached the clouds above. For many years, the kingdom lived in peace until following the tragic death of their king. The demon king disguised himself as the chancellor and claimed the kingdom for himself. Sealing off the castle from the rest of the kingdom, he locked the princess away within the tower. Day after day, the princess wept, gazing out the window at her poor kingdom below. Around that time, a young knight from a faraway land was squeezing the salt water from his cloak. Looking up from where he'd washed ashore on the beach, he saw the castle in the distance. That castle would be his destination and the start of his adventure. Okay. Oh, come on. I lost again? But I even had the full attack skills this time. That stupid demon king. How are you supposed to beat him? Guess there's really no way unless you get more party members. Oh crap, look at the time. Time for school. Let's play again after school, okay? Sure thing. See you later. Why Why don't they get, go to school? I gotta go wake John up. They don't, they don't have any shoes. I love the animation on this. Is this me? Do I move? Oh, I move. Wait, I didn't want to leave yet. Okay, it's too late, I left. <laughs> the world above. John, come on. The bell already rang. If we don't get back to the dig site, the mayor's gonna dock your pay. Okay, I hadn't looked at this stuff yet. Yeah, close that seat, come on, John. You can refrigerate your memories here, but when you take them out again, will the new you really be you? Save your memories? Save. Alright, so this is giving like post-apocalyptic trailer park? Up at the crack of dawn, bleed for every coin you earn. Must be tough being a digger. Look at the way he runs, so cute. Men are the absolute worst. But aren't you seeing someone right now? Can't say that's very convincing coming from you. My molar is different. And you expect us to believe that? Ha! It's called love. You wouldn't understand, even if I told you, dear. What are y'all talking about? Shouldn't you be at work or something by now? I knew it! You're one of those types, aren't you? Those types? Yeah! A loser! Can never hold a job, am I right? Hey! Every day, it's the same damn thing. I ain't nothing to do down here but sleep. Maybe I'll get lucky and dream me up a son today. You look at him scratching his booty. John! Looking so off today, as always. In a hurry again today. I'd expect no less from Pot Rock Isle number one digger. Talk? Occupied. Ah! I could go up there. I could go up here. Just turning on some water. Oh, turning on both of the. Turn it off. Okay. Don't want to waste water. Doesn't seem like a place that has a lot of a lot of water options. If it isn't little Sam. Made any new friends lately? Still wanna go to the world above? Yeah, I wanna go to the world above. School front. You shouldn't be here. Okay. Okay, so the school front is nothing. Y'all know. Oh my god, there's other other parts. Mayor's estate. I feel like there's a lot of- they're giving us a lot of leniency to go explore, and they shouldn't. Because I'm an explorer, and I'm gonna look at every crevice before I do what I actually am sp supposed to do. The mayor don't like to be bothered. I'd make myself scarce if I was you. Stop right there. The mayor's taking his rest. Alright, fine. I wasn't trying to do nothing. Okay, maybe I was. Okay, so, so we can't explore there. 
can we explore over here? You're one of them diggers, aren't you? You best be careful not not to go up, up, up. Else disaster's gonna come down, down, down. Well, hey, John, what are you doing here? You better be scooting along if you don't want to be late. Everyone's telling me I'm gonna be late, and I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Okay, just let me explore. Digger dorms. My God, there's so much to explore. Dig site. Hold on, okay, this is where we're supposed to go, so we haven't, I'm gonna go explore some more. <laughs> I know it's frustrating, I know, but I have to. I can't not, there's other things I have to do. Until it tells me I can't do it, I'm gonna do it. Oh, well, 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 if it isn't John. Ha, vying for a drink this early, are we? You're no better than Chuck. Don't come running to me if you pass out drunk down in the down in the site. He's not letting me go, is he? I'm gonna just pretend I didn't see this. You got it. You two run off to the dig site now. And John, if you're gonna drink, at least do it out of sight of the kid. I didn't know it was a bar. I thought it was a. I thought it was a little tunnel. Okay. I think this area is the only area we didn't go. This area. Rocket Cemetery. Hi. Can we talk to you? No. Okay, just a cemetery for rockets. Okay. The art is very, very cool. All right, we're here at the dig site now. We're doing what we're supposed to do. I exhausted all the other exploration options. Oh, come on, don't be so stingy. I'm only borrowing it, two days tops. I'll give it back as soon as I finish. You say that every time. Yet somehow I've never gotten anything back. That's, well, 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 John's here. Mr. Punctuality, as always. Your watch must have been carved by the god of time himself. And you're looking as adorable as always, Sam. Do you still remember what I taught you? Of course. Over pit, under rock, buried treasure round the clock. In the mine, rocks go blast, safety first, or you won't last. Gotta dig, gotta dig, dig to make those riches flow. Bravo, you'll make an excellent digger one day, Sam. I like I'm just I'm just mixing up the uh, the accents. She sure will even better than John, I'd say. Damn, we've got a problem, a big problem. S -s 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 slugs, slugs. John, thank God you're here. Come with me. Slugs. Now wait a goddamn minute. You shouldn't be running off all pell mell like little Sammy. It's dangerous in there. You should stay right right here with your uncle Chage. Chage? I just realized his name was Chage. We'll protect you from them slugs. But, but I'm fine. A very good point. Sam, would you like to hear about when the mayor went up against the evil dragon? Not that one again. All right, here I go. Slugs it is. The slugs are in the cave to the west. <laughs> there you are, John. The slugs are in the cave to the west. And you, go find the key to the storeroom. We'll need... <laughs> We'll need the bombs in there to take care of any slug nests. I'm ready. I'm going. Hands in my pockets. I'm ready. Let's do it. Oh, I got my frying pan? Okay, I got my frying pan. Alright. Can I just hit him? What do I do? Oh, I gotta click, maybe? Oh! Yep, gotta click him. Oh, this is so sad. Whoa. Who is it? John? Is, is that you, John? No answer. Must be John. John, don't open the door. Those slugs are sapping our electricity. Unless you take care of them, we won't be able to turn the lights back on. Oh, I'll take care of them, all right. So John doesn't talk, does he? He doesn't talk much. Okay, now what? Those slugs are sapping our electricity. All right, I, d I got them, I thought. Oh, I see. Oh! Oh! Do I have to turn off the electricity first? Connect. Okay, I have like no hearts because I'm a dum-dum. 
There we go. All right, you live and you learn, you know what I mean? Is that what I was supposed to do? I don't know. There, now that light's on. John! The nest, John! If you don't bomb their nest, they'll just keep coming back. All right, that's disgusting. That is gnarly. Truly gnarly. What does he want me to do? Oh God. I don't know how he wants me to bomb their nests. Hmm. Oh, well, that's fun. It's kind of like a little, a little puzzle, puzzle maze situation. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Now I hook that up. Do I use the key on this? Or do I open this? There we go, okay. Take bomb. Yeah, I love the music as well. The the world building, the music, and the, the aesthetics, the art style all create a really good atmosphere. And I, I do like it, I enjoy it. And so far, place bomb. Do I leave? Nice. So far, the, um, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, Lord have mercy. So far, the fighting is not bad. It's not bad. So do I go get another bomb? Does this, like, produce more bombs? Oh, it does. Oh, that's fun. Let's go plant another bomb. Hell yeah! That is satisfying, I'll tell you what. Alright, now do I go talk to this guy? There's even more of them slugs past that door over there. Watch out for the glowing nest though. That's where the real sons of bitches come from. Okay, glowing nests, alright! Glowing nests. Oh, I should get another bomb maybe? I'm gonna get more, I'm gonna go get more before I head off into the into the night. Hell yeah, stock up, baby. Oh shit. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of here. Didn't mean to do that. Shit, 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 shit. Hell yeah. That is, I'll tell you what, this is satisfying. I love a game that has remote options because I really dislike just a bunch like I, I really like when there's a mix of combat styles basically I hate when it's like just one thing for a long time or when it's just up close combat and that's kind of hard I don't know if I care about that area you know what I mean does that make sense hell yeah Mm-hmm, look at me opening things up. God damn it. Bruh. 
Run! Nice. Oh. Is it another bomb? Oh, I can pick up the bomb? <gasps> Ooh, bombs replenished! Fun. Should I go get more bombs? <gasps> don't! Don't! Don't eat me! <laughs> well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? I thought you were one of those carniv carnivorous critters. It's me, quack doctor, Boguda. No, 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 no. I've got to stop calling myself that. I'll stop getting any patience. By the way, did you know that those slugs secrete a most peculiar gel? They do. And it can even be used as an adhesive of sorts to heal wounds. That's why I'm here, to get my hands on some of that gel. How was I supposed to know how crazed those mucilaginous mites would be? I had no choice but to hide myself away in here. D don't go. Please, don't go. You're that, that... Yes, you're that remarkable digger, aren't you? John, was it? I heard that you were the first one to dig yourself up a person. What? Yes, yes. Here, take this, would you? What'd I get? A hot dog? I may not have been able to find any gel, but that doesn't mean I'm useless. Give that thing a try. A hot dog? A hot dog? You want me to give the hot dog a try? There we go. Okay. Well, I didn't need that. God damn it. Those slugs are no joke. One zap and they'll knock you right out. They are, however, surprisingly delicious. A little sweet, a little spicy. Why, one might even be able to turn them into a medicine of sorts. Okay, well, thank you, sir. I just ate that hot dog. I did not need to eat the hot dog. What I do need is some more bombs, though. Should I go back and get more? What do y'all think? I think I should. I'm going back. I'm going back. Oh. What the hell? John! S -s Slugs! A whole mess of them! In here? Oh, down there? Okay, let me get more bombs, buddy. Let me get more bombs, alright? Hell yeah, I feel so powerful when I have ten bombs. What the? <gasps> you big lout, what'd you just do? Huh? Didn't you say there were slugs inside? He locked me in there? Is that what he did? What the hell? Oh, I can break through those. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Wait, oh. So I know now that there's, they do give me some bombs occasionally. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Hey now, hey now. Yeah, give me the heart. Where are y'all falling from? Hell yeah. This is very fun action. This is like the most fun action I've had in a game in a while. Yes, including the past two cozy demos I did. I like, I really enjoy the combination. It, it reminds me of like Breath of the Wild, how you can have the combo of remote and in, in close combat. I think John's gonna be all right. Eh, it's a hard call. Guy's really got himself neck high and a cock up high this time. Yeah, thanks to you. Oh, John. <laughs> we were just uh, <laughs> talking about how to rescue you. John. Damn, everyone needs John's help. The mayor, the mayor's on his way, John. Wait, I didn't even go explore the, the under the depths down below fully. Well, crap. Shift's over and I've got a whole lot of nothing. Mayor's not gonna be happy. I, I, I'm getting out of here. Hey, wait! 
Come on, John. Mayor catches you and there'll be hell to pay. I don't know what y'all are talking about. I'm trying to go back down into the the uh, abyss. I had not fully explored yet. I'll come on back later. Once again, me not listening to directions. Ooh. I found a gear part, huh? Talking about finding nothing, I found a gear part. I haven't dug up a single scrap. Oh. <clears throat> I haven't dug up a single scrap. The mayor's gonna kill me. Don't concern me, traitor. What did you say? <laughs> Hush, all of y'all. He's here. Ooh, the mayor. All right, you good for nothings. Let me see if you've lived up to your name today. Empty. And another one. Empty. You really are good for nothings. <gasps> oh. All of you. And you. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Why is this kid still in here? You think this is a playground? She belongs in school. The tuition fee will come out of your paycheck, of course. Did you hear that, John? I get to go to school. He's gone? Whoa. I thought that old fogey was gonna dock my pay again. Scared us half to death. At least our salaries made it out unscathed. Found. Sand droop times two. What is a sand droop? Damn sand droops again. Can't I get paid in cash for once? I've eaten nothing but sand droops all month. Well, at least things worked out. Gotta hand it to you, John. You really do get us out of some binds. Guess you're off to school tomorrow, ain't that right, little Sammy? It's gonna seem pretty empty around here without you. I'll be back, I promise. Don't you go playing hooky now. You gotta listen to that teacher of yours. Yeah, yeah. I know, I know. Don't you I know, we mean it. Don't want you getting shipped off to Sharon on us. Ain't that right, John? Ah, John. That pan of yours. Huh? Oh no! John, your pan, it's broken! Have Mason take a gander at it. Yeah, ain't nothing that old co codger can't fix. You can find that gent at Sunnyside Ranch. See if he can't tune that puppy up for you. Alright, alright, let's go do that. On the next episode, the knight faces his greatest challenge yet. Will Snow Peak Castle survive this deadly threat? Tune in next time. Dang, just when it was getting good. He's probably going to find a new ally next time. I don't know, at this rate. I'd say we still have two weeks left before they show the new character. Hey guys! Oh, hey Sam, you off work? Is Earthborn already over? Yeah, just finished. If you want to watch it, you'll have to wait for the rerun. Today, one of the four generals attacked Snoopy Castle. So now, the knight's heading there to stop him. It's weird though, I don't remember this part from the game. Oh right, about that. I heard it's something that happens in post-game. You have to defeat the Demon King first. After that, you can start a new game. New game? You don't even have any party members yet. It's gonna take us five billion years to get new game. You should play Earthborn too, Sam. The more of us playing, the better chance we can beat the Demon King. But I don't have a memory card. Old Stash, you should buy one for Sam. After all, without the memory card, she's basically can't make any friends. You'll buy one for me? Really? Oh gosh, oh wow, I'm finally going to be able to play Earthborn. Time to put your money where your mouth is, old stash. Hello Grocery has memory cards for sale. Alright, let's spend all of our all of our wages for the day. Why, it's been a long time since I've seen your face around here, John. You don't normally do your shopping at my store. At any rate, what can I get you today? Okay, we can do that. She's so happy. Now I finally have my own memory card. Something for Sam then, was it? Come to think of it, you spent a lot of your hours on that thing when you were young, didn't you, John? That, uh, oh, what was it called again? Right, right, Earthborn, that was it. Now we're cooking. We got ourselves a mage. Should we go to the castle and fight the demon then? You're not even going to grind a bit first? We still have time before the Demon King's ritual is complete. Warp to the royal castle! Are you even listening to me? Guys, I got one. I got a memory card. Perfect timing. We're on our way to the royal castle. 
Not that we're actually gonna be able to win or anything. Okay, okay, gosh. I mean, I guess we do have a mage now, so there's a chance we might be able to beat him. Why don't you try, Sam? Maybe you'll have some beginner's luck. Really? But I... I don't know how to play. Don't worry. It's not like Karada can beat him either. Does Karada have a chin? I mean, what are you waiting for? Let's get this show on the road. It's already pretty late. My mom's gonna be calling me for dinner soon. Okay, okay. I'll give it a try. Oh my god. It's starting, it's starting. First, you need to plan out your strategy. Teach him a lesson, Sam. First, use the knight's strong attack skill. The knight's strong attack skill? First, you have to choose skill, then choose strong attack. Okay, okay. Let me give you a tip. Even if you put the monkey in your back row, he can still help you fight. Choose switch and swap him with your mage. Just like that. Now, you can use your major skills. What, fireball? Ah! I don't know what I'm doing. Here it comes. The Demon King's ultimate skill, energy sap. Now what are you going to do? You don't have any AP left. All according to plan. Pixball, go. Oh, yeah. Sometimes the voices just come out after a while. Next, use an AP potion. Okay, just like that. Now we'll be able to use some awesome skills. Ooh. Uh oh. Here it comes. The Demon King the second ultimate skill, Hypno Wave. All strong monsters use this move. This isn't the time for you to show off. Think of a way out of this. But that's the point. There isn't a way. Your entire party is being controlled now. You can't do anything. Wow. He's got us in a chokehold. Okay, can I can I put my AP up? Oh no. This is the final battle. We can't run away. Well, I'm gonna die. I don't know how to go back. Oh, cute, okay. So we died. I'm sorry. I think I lost. Don't worry about it. The fact that you're able to hold on for so long is pretty good for a newbie. I already said you need to gain more levels first, but no. No one listens to me. Please don't kill me. Oh, crap. Look at the time. Gotta get home for dinner. See you tomorrow. You get back here right now. I'm gonna head home too then. See you guys tomorrow. Hey! Uh, whatever. Guess we'll have to play tomorrow. Oh, right. Guess what? I get to go to school tomorrow, too. You serious? Why didn't you say so earlier? That's awesome. Now we can hang out tomorrow at school, too. Here, take this. Think of it as a reward for today. 
Slime. This is a Pixball. Ooh, achievement unlocked. Pixball newbie. You can use these to get more items in Earthborn. You get them from that capsule machine over there. Just put in a token, pull the crank, and bam, Pixball. Anyways, I should head off now too, but I'll see you tomorrow. Make sure you're not too late. I will. I'll leave super early. See you tomorrow. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All right, so we needed to go to sunset something to fix my frying pan. I'm hungry, John. See, you need to be taking better care of her. Okay, okay, sorry, John. I mean, sorry, Sam. This is also weirdly, because I feel like I normally get lost in a lot of maps when I first start playing. This one's really easy to, um, sorry, I have uh, notifications up. There we go. <laughs> I like immediately knew what I was doing and where I was going, which is cool. You're not gonna be able to cook with that, John. Well, what am I supposed to do? Rest. We're having sleep for dinner because I don't know where to get my pan fixed. La 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 la. What? I was singing? Was I really? That's all fine and dandy. Where do I get my frying pan fixed? Petrock Isle. Well, we haven't been here. Oh, Sunnyside Ranch. Nice. Okay. We found that by complete accident. There ain't nothing in this world I can't fix. Name's Mason, Mason the Fixer. Whoa, wowza, this pan. It's the same one a right brave bunch of girls once used as their weapon. It can make a mean stir fry too. Oh my gosh. You've got my attention now, kiddo. Let me up the ante on that pan for you, huh? The rules are simple. Get the droop into the loop. I call it droop loops. Ingenious, isn't it? I'm thinking of copywriting it. Here he goes again. What the hell is a droop loop, huh? Who cares? I wanna see what this guy's made of. Go, John, go. Hold to unleash a powerful attack. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Not like that. Try it again. First, you gotta charge your strength, then aim like your life depends on it, and finally, release everything in one bone-crushing hit. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I did it! Come on! Wonderful! Brilliant! Seems like you've already got the knack to whack. <laughs> knack to whack. That's a good one. Yeah, if you're five. Mason's expressivity continues to astound. What you're holding can be used for more than just taking thugs' heads off. It can might make a mighty fine dinner to boot. Dinner! Let's go home and make dinner, John. I'm starving. Here, take this. Oh, thank you. It's the droop you just gave the boot. A bit droopy now, though. Haha, <laughs> droopy droop. That's the good one. Okay, where's my quest log? Oh, okay. Okay, here's a map. So this was Sunnyside. This is where I live. Them's the, 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 the digging stuff. I got my backpack, I got my droops. Got recipes. Oh, got collections. Got... Quest items, weapons. Okay, in progress. Hurry to the dig site. If you're late, your repay will be docked. Save the dig site. Ask Mason at City Side Ranch. Pain is fixed. Dinner. Okay. I feel like dinner will be the last part of this chapter. Dinner, dinner, dinner. What's for dinner tonight, huh, John? Is it sand droop? Tell me we're going to eat the sand droop, huh, John? Ooh. Damn, that's all our food. We're really we're we're doing paycheck by paycheck, huh? This is fun. Oh, I have to press it. Fuck. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, Oh. Eee. Ooh. Amazing. That was 
Oh my god, I could I could I could do that cooking sequence again and again and again. The hard as nail sand droop becomes soft as soup after cooking. Pour it over some noodles. Yum. All right. I get to go to school tomorrow. Karata said that at school there's big courtyard. But but there's nothing blue there, John. Nothing green there either. The mayor said all that stuff is fake. But John, I know it's real. I saw it, John. All right, that was the prologue. Chapter one coming up for air. John, wake up, John. I have to go to school today. How cute. Give her some shoes. He sleeps on the chair? Hurry, John. Today I get to go to school with Karada and the others. I don't get why she didn't get to go to school before. Was she too young? I wait for you at the door. Hot Rock Isle, hourly alert. I'm not talking to anyone. I'm bringing her straight to school. We're not playing today. Uh uh. No talking. Okay. <laughs> Annoying brat. You. There. Stop right there. I'm new here. Today's my first day. Your first day? At my school? And who, may I ask, said you could attend my school? Um, yesterday? Silence. Those without a reference letter aren't allowed in my school. Man. You asshole. No one gets into my school without a reference letter from the mayor. W the mayor made us go. What are you talking about? Stop right there. We came to get a reference letter for the mayor. Reference letter, huh? Hmph, then I suppose it's fine. Thank you. Gosh. Wasn't so mean to us. Holy cow, this house is huge. The mayor must be super rich. Who's there? Oh, it's John. How did you two get in? School, look at the little picture of him. School, when did I ever say anything about going to school? Yesterday, at the dig site. A derelict child like you has no place in school. You must be mistaken. You wanted to see us, Mr. Mayor? Oh, little Sammy, what are you still doing here? Shouldn't you be at school? Don't tell me. You're playing hooky, aren't you? Didn't you promise you were gonna listen to your teacher? Ain't no good to be breaking promises now. Truer words have never been spoken by man. Those who break their word are sent hot, skipping straight to old Sharon. Ain't that right, Mr. Mayor? Ah, uh, um, yes, of course. You should always, um, keep your word. <laughs> Run along to school now, you adorable little jack and ape. But I need a reference letter. Right, right, right. Here you are. Don't lose it, or else you won't be able to get in. Yay! Oh, the dig, the dig buddies came through. I love that. Imbeciles, blockheads, good for nothings. No one, and I repeat, no one is allowed to enter without my permission. Out of my sight. Damn, glad I'm not in there. I mean, the man just yells. What's he gonna do? So far he hasn't done anything but yell. Ha, ah, what a loser, just like your old man. Loser. Aw, mean. Loser. Aw. The lady's not doing anything. Did I say you could look at me? If you don't want to be a loser, you'll go to the surface. Just like your crazy dad. Just like your crazy dad. The surface? You mean like the forbidden land at the dig site? Exactly. And then he'll never come back. Ha ha ha. So mean. Stop that! Here comes another one, Grandis. It's that kid John picked up from off the street. No one wants her. What a weirdo. And look at that hair. Why is it all white? Ha ha ha. Just like an old hag. Old hag. Old hag. You shouldn't bully people. Yeah, and what are you going to do about it, huh? Grandis' uncle as the mayor. <laughs> the mayor. 
Don't tell me you want to go to the surface in this place, do you? Maybe I do. There's nothing scary up there. In fact, it's beautiful there. Clear blue skies, green grass. Who are you? Who is she? You'll find out one day. Go now, your destiny waits. Who do you think you are, huh? Talking to me like that. You're nothing but a street rat. Street rat. Hey, listen up. Grandis is talking to you. What'd you say? <laughs> Whatever. Let's get out of here. If you don't engage, they, they get bored and they leave. I thought I told you. Without a reference letter, you can't... We got one. We got one. I censored myself. <laughs> Not sure how you got this, but I suppose it will do. You better be smart, young lady, and don't cause me any trouble. Yeah, I'm going to school, John. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I should have said. Okay, now what? Hey, there's no open house today. Parents aren't allowed in school. Let's talk to this little guy. Those three, they're terrifying. Oh, he did this thing. Okay, I will end it there. I understand why this game has so much hype around it, why everybody's playing it. I understand. Just that com that little combat alone was so much fun. Like I said, I love a mix of combat where it's like a remote option and a close, close contact option. It reminds me of Breath of the Wild. I love the cooking. I love that there's recipes and there's a whole cooking element to it. That's always fun. And the cooking animation, it was so satisfying and so cute. And I love the music. I love the music as a whole. I love the animation style as a whole. I don't know if there's anything I don't like. The story feels like straightforward. Like obviously there's stuff we don't know yet, but it it feels like you understand where the story is going or it's setting you up in a in a nice way. I like that it's set up in chapters. I like that the quest log is like clear and straightforward. I love that there's a little bit of room for exploration, but it still kind of guides you where to go. I love it. I really like it. It's it's like a little bit more on the serious action-y side of cozy games, I think, but I think it definitely has like a cozy vibe to it. From what I've played, I recommend it. What do y'all think? Do you like it? Does it, does it interest you at all? Have you played it have you been liking it have you played a little bit and like stop not come back to it or have you like been addicted to it let me know in the comments i want to hear so fun so fun i love it i will see y'all later have a great week i love you stay cozy bye